Tech Cocktail Conversations, candid insights from startup founders, entrepreneurs, and thought leaders from around the globe. Uh, my name is Gabriel Palermo. I'm going to be a senior studying biomedical engineering at ASU. And I started G3 Box with three other engineering students about a year ago. And we convert shipping containers into medical clinics. Um, it all started about two years ago um, with two separate class projects in engineering. And one project was focused on turning a container into a maternity clinic uh, for use in developing countries. And then another project was focused on using a container for disaster response. And so each, proje each project was working um, simultaneously. And we both won some funding through ASU, and I guess we decided to merge about a year ago to apply for the Edson program at ASU. You know, this whole s this started as a project uh, two years ago when Jan Snyder, um, he's part of, he started Sustainable Resources. His idea was to have a village of these different container clinics. You know, one would be a maternity clinic, another could be, you know, a place to sleep. So just this whole village idea. And so we're working with him. He has very close ties to the people in Africa, in Kenya and Malawi. And so it's through him that we know the people there. And he's been a big part of, you know, helping us get to that stage. Two years ago, we made a promise to the people in Kenya to build a maternity clinic for them. So one of the clinics that we're working on right now is a maternity clinic for a village in Kenya. So I'm currently a senior in biomedical engineering. I have a year left. Uh, another team member, Billy Walters, he's our chief financial officer. He has another semester left in mechanical engineering. And then our last two team members, Susanna and Clay, just finished up this May with their master's in mechanical engineering. One of the biggest challenges just as a team is time management, uh, being able to figure out where you draw the line between school and homework, studying, and putting all your time into the business. And so being able to schedule meetings around your school schedule, having agendas set for everything, and just making sure you're very dil diligent about your time was really important for us just as students. I think, you know, all of us saying, wa want this to be our full-time job for a very long time. Uh, this is all our passion and our career, hopefully, within the next couple of years. And so we really want to see it go big. Uh, we want to affect the lives of women and children and also disaster response victims, you know, as many as possible. So if this means we have to go global and have manufacturing sites in several different countries, that's what we'll do. Or if we think we can make the biggest impact operating out of Arizona, that's what we'll do too. So.